In general, this type of gel is required to separate single-stranded DNA or RNA fragments, such as synthesized or labeled oligonucleotides, or products from enzymatic cleavage reactions. The separation range is dependent on the polyculamide concentration. Urea in combination with heat denatures the sample and single-stranded molecules migrate within the gel matrix according to their molecular weight. This video presents the pouring, running and processing of a typical gel. Hello, my name is Heike Sommer. I'm with Nanyang Technological University. In this demonstration I'm going to show you how to perform a denaturing polyacrylamide gel electrophoresis. Use clean glass plates and assemble the gel sandwich according to manufacturer's description. Fix the gel in the gel casting stand or chamber. Silenize the glass plates of large gels if the gel tends to stick to the glass plates. Choose a gel size and thickness according to your separation requirements. Prepare the gel solution according to current protocols in molecular biology. Choose the concentration of polyacrylamide that suits your separation requirements best. Higher percentage of acrylamide will resolve lower molecular weight fragments. Use ultra-pure urea and mix with the desired amount of polyacrylamide in a beaker or bottle. Add 10x TBE buffer to the solution and fill up to the required volume with water. Heat the solution for 20 seconds in the microwave and mix it gently until all urea is dissolved. You can store the solution if necessary. For larger gel volumes, repeat the microwave step until the solution is hand warm. Avoid heating the solution too much. Do not overheat.